What's up, Average Dad fans? Welcome back to another video. And today, well, today, I need your help. I seem to have got myself in a situation where I've ordered way too many phones and I need to make way too much content. So, I want your steer as to how I should create it, what you want to see, the phones you want compared against each other, what you want to see unboxed, first impressions. Let's talk. So, yes, I have um, kind of not realizing, but I've ordered a lot of phones. Um, you would think that January would be a slow month for smartphones, people are skint, but oh how wrong I was. So, for context, arriving this week, actually no, we'll not start with what's arriving this week, we'll start with what I have right now. Right now, I have the iPhone 15 Pro Max, the Google Pixel 8 Pro, and the Nubia Z60 Ultra. Now, two of those are absolute flagship. However, I would argue that the Nubia is as well. So let's call that three flagship phones with three fantastic camera setups. Well, tomorrow I receive my S24 Ultra. I also receive my Oppo X7 Ultra. So that's another two flagship phones with flagship camera setups. If you're keeping count, that's five. I also have ordered the Vivo X100 Pro Global Edition. You can find that on Wanda, link in description. That's six. And lucky number seven, I have ordered the Honor Magic 6 Pro. So all in all, seven flagship candy bar style phones and you know you've got an addiction and a problem when you forget about another flagship thousand pound device. I literally just ordered the OnePlus 12. Is that eight now? The Magnificent 8? I would typically do first impressions, reviews, long-term reviews, and versus videos between them all. Let me know in the comments if that's what you want to see for all of the phones. Also let me know, are there particular devices you want to see head to head? For context, trying to create a comparison video between seven, six, five, even four flagship phones is damn tough and it's damn long as far as for you to watch. So to keep it short, I typically like to put two or three phones at most against each other. So, let me know in the comments the phones that you want to see compared against each other. Ideally, your top three. I then want to know, because my channel is all about the community, what do you want to know? I put a lot of weight and time into the camera sections of videos and less on the software side. Do you want to see more of the software side when it comes to first impressions or review? Or do you want to see more, even more, camera side? Do you want to know the facts and figures? Or do you want my own unbiased, honest as always, opinions? Let me know in the comments. I want to ensure that you are getting the best content that I can make. And... It goes without saying, any questions, any feedback you give, I will take on board, I will answer. For this channel to work in 2024, I need to continue to take your feedback on board and listen to what you have to say. And I want to get you, the viewers, subscribers and members, more involved. So, with all that being said, there are two phones that I have in my possession. Those that watched my Honor video a couple of weeks ago will know what I'm talking about. It's the two phones provided to me by Doji. I will be doing a review on these rugged phones with night vision, walkie-talkie, 6,500 mAh batteries, all that stuff. And then as you know, 
At the end of that review, so please watch, I will be giving away both phones, one to members who have joined the channel and one to a commenter on that previous honor video. So if you haven't already, I would recommend you go back and comment on that video. I will not count any comments on any other video. It has to be on that specific honor video. Now, I do think I mentioned giveaway in the description if you're trying to find it. So I'm not sure what this video is, but all I know is I'm looking for your steer help and guidance. As we've just discussed, I've got eight flagship phones. I mean, it's actually mental to think how lucky we are as tech enthusiasts and addicts to have the X7 Ultra, the S24 Ultra, the OnePlus 12, the Magic, all those devices out at the same time. I know you're not too keen on the iPhone 15 Pro Max, so I don't think that'll get many votes. I also know that you're not bored of the Pixel 8 Pro, which utterly confuses me because I've had that Pixel 8 Pro for a few months now and I've got it for sale for like £600 and nobody seems to want it, which is just wild. Anyway, leave your comments, let me know what you think and of course, every single device I've mentioned at some point over the next few weeks will be for sale. So you know to hit me up on Instagram. Until next time.